Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fireside and Terra. Hope everybody's doing well. I know. It's been a minute. Trust me, I know. I had a bit of a journey I had to go on. I had some things I had to deal with. Some coping to do. And I had to realign my physical world to bring myself back to my spiritual side. Be able to come here and do this for you guys. So... Virgo, we're going to throw them down for February 2023. Thanks for coming down and hanging out. We're going to tip down and we're going to get it rolling. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, I ask that you give me clarity of mind and peace of heart to be able to bring Virgo to their highest possible good and put them in their highest possible spiritual path. Let me see what I need to see, hear what I need to hear, feel what I need to feel, and speak what I need to speak. Thank you so much for the blessings you've given to me. Help me pl pass them along to my Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus friends. One to show, one to go from the Wisdom Oracle. One to show, one to go. One to show, one to go. One to show, one to go. Virgo, February 2023, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. One to show, one to go. Unfinished Symphony, number 10. Unfinished business, an incomplete lesson, lack of closure, the need to make amends. Closure. Closure. Hmm. All right. Tarot Illuminati would like to speak today, so. Let's. Fire, earth, air, water. Fire, earth, air, water. Fire, earth, air, water. Fire, earth, air, water. Fire, earth, air, water, fire, earth, air, water, speak truth, speak truth. Fire, earth, air, water, fire, earth, air, water, speak truth, speak truth. Oh, Virgo, you showed up and so did the devil. Fire, earth, air, water, fire, earth, air, water, speak truth, speak truth, speak truth, speak truth. Three majors. Woo! Whoa! We're not going to go over this entire rack of cards. The Six of Swords did show itself. Go over that later, I guess. Ace of Wands. Ace of Swords, Six of Swords. You moved on from something, or you're about to, or you would like to, possibly with a little help. Rider Waite, Clarity. Clarity for my Virgo friends. Clarity for my Virgo friends. Okay. You flew out. Why on earth would you feel like you're not good enough, Virgo? Or are you connected to someone else?
you're connected to someone else. Death. Scorpio. Oh boy. Sick of being single. Knight of Cups. Hmm. Transition. Someone offering a cup of love. Logic. New thought process, a new way of looking at things, a transition. Death is the butterfly card. It's not physical death. It's not it's transition. Something coming to an end so something new can begin. It's the circle. Why is the hermit here? Why is the hermit here? The world. Oh, you went on a journey. Ace of Cups. Unfinished Symphony. Fortune. Ah, ha 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 ha. Yes. Very interesting indeed. Virgo, apparently something is screaming at you that you need to move on and move forward. But you're heavily connected to something. Something new awaits you. But you have something you have to finish first. Why is the devil here? Why is the devil here? Star. Emptying out the cups so you can start over. Four cups. Something is trying to offer you a cup, but you just sit there and stare at those three. You're not even looking at what's trying to be handed to you because you're connected to something else. You're healing because you haven't moved on. Something is left unfinished. Ten cups. It's finished. Yes, it's, it's happiness and it's joy and it's fulfillment, but tens are endings. Transitions, full circles, something new, something you're ignoring because you're being pulled by this devil. Can be toxic, can be sexual. And oddly safe and comfortable. But I don't feel like you're comfortable. Hierophant. Could be a marriage. Could be a Taurus.
Hmm. It's timing. It's about timing. The hair. Why the hierophant? Why the hierophant? Justice reversed. Wow. Devil reversed. Double wow. I'll pull that. <clears throat> Page of Pentacles. Holy smokes, Virgo. Safely toxic, toxically safe. But imbalanced. Stable, but imbalanced. You're being called to pull away because there's something better. High Priestess. Duality. It's the unknown. Only the high priestess knows. You're weak. King of Wands. High priestess again. Six of Cups again. Sorry. Six of Cups reversed. High priestess again. Unfinished symphony, unfinished business. Something needs to be finished. You're bound. You need to be unbound. Eight Pentacles. May need some help. May need some help. Holy Moses. Five of Swords reversed at the bottom of the deck. going to take some work. It's going to take some time. There's going to be salty feelings. Truths need to be uncovered. I think you know what the truth is. You're drained. You're tired. You're whipped. Why is the king of wands here? Look at it. He's oddly out of place. Seven of wands. The internal struggle. Carrying a wand, carrying a wand. Could have something to do with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It's empowerment. It's empowerment. Fighting that internal battle, it's fighting that enemy you can't see. Some of you may be bound and you don't realize it. Or you do realize it and you don't know how to get, get out. It's empowerment, it's work. It's reading between the lines. It's realizing that the symphony needs to be over. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Seven Swords. Knight of Pentacles. Seven Cups reversed. There's that Pentacle again.
Why seven swords? Anxiety. Flew right out. Flew out in front of the camera. You saw it. I feel like whoever this is or whatever this is, this toxic devil, this thing that you are bound to, it's going to try to keep you bound. They keep coming back or you keep coming back to them. There's something better. Page of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, there's something better. There's something more solid. There's something more stable. And you seek this pentacle. Something keeps you bound. Dependent. You strive to be independent. Coming in to confuse you. Why the Seven of Cups? Why the Seven of Cups? Why the Seven of Cups? Why Seven Cups Reversed? Why Seven Cups Reversed? Hangman Reversed. Keep you stuck. to keep you from seeing from a different perspective, to keep you from reading between the lines, to keep you in the dark, to keep you blind. Knight of Wands, bottom of the deck. Six swords, five swords, King of Pentacles. There's the king, the page, the knight, the king. Two of Pentacles. It's about finding balance. Help, possibly from an old soul, old friend, somebody you've known for a while. Sibling, someone from childhood, trying to help you find that balance. Somebody pull through the battle with you to help you get unbound. Wheel of Fortune in the upright. They won't want to let you go. Prince of Wands, bottom of the deck. Knight of Wands, same card. Three of Wands, Queen of Cups reversed. Four of Pentacles reversed. Wow, oh my gosh. You gotta break away. Three of Cups reversed. They're gonna try to hold you back and reel you in and keep you bound. They're gonna try to manipulate you, keep you in a cage. One to go. Never ending story. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Unfinished symphony and never ending story. Thirty seven. Self criticism, the wounded ego, unnecessary dramas. Here's where it ties together. There is a story woven through the imperfect fabric of life that tells of hurt and loss. Rejection and humiliation, self-loathing and arrogance, and all manner of suffering born of unnecessary dramas. It is the old story whose refrain is that you cannot do this, must not go there, should not say that, lest your world come crumbling down. Today, know that none of this is actually true. The sky is not falling. The voice you hear is just a small, scared, conditioned part of you that got stuck in a lie, wants to protect you, and needs to be seen as a victim. Love that lost piece of you. Fear is all it knows. Distorted guidance is preventing you from being true to yourself. 
You are not your story. And the narrator is simply the voice of your fearful part, small and vulnerable and easily soothed. Virgo, my dear friend. It is up to you whether your symphony is finished and whether your story comes to an end so the new story can begin. Know that you are loved, friends. Be blessed. And I will catch you again in the next. I don't know when that's going to be. I'm on a hot streak today. I'm just getting the energy out while I can. But take care. Namaste. Talk soon.